is the love reading for the month of um, January 2020. Capis. Capis. Let's see what's going on for the Capricorns for the month of January 2020. Capis. All right. So I see some blocks. It's coming up for the Capricorn. And I see true love, blocks with true love is coming up. I see these true love could be turned to friendships. I see um, issues with family is here for you Capricorns, okay. Um, I see that some of you men 45, 40 years and older, 45 years and older could be having blocks in your relationship. I see a love triangle is now blocked, okay? I see true love. Some of you um, men between the ages of 25 and 45 is going to be having some true love coming up. I see friendships is going to be bonded. But I see um, there could be divorce for some of you. Definitely, there could be divorce for some of you. So I see children's children are affecting your life. So whatever is transpiring, you Capricorn, some of you could be getting um, um, pregnant, but uh, some of you are going to be creating new families. I see children are on your mind. Some of you want to get pregnant. Um, I see some of you, you want to get pregnant, but you don't have a donor. And I see you're going to be asking a friend. And this person is going to say yes, okay? This person is definitely going to be saying yes. So, whatever the, the triangles, the love triangles was, I see that those love triangles are being blocked. So, some of you were dealing with some love triangles, but I see that they are being blocked, okay? So, let's see what you're coming in this month with calling your soulmate. And I knew that would come up. So call in your soulmate Capricorns because I see a blockage. And um, if you were in a, a love triangle, I see that is being blocked also. New love is definitely coming in. So what we see here and, and whoever this new love is coming in is really true love. This person as um, some of you are going to be meeting someone that stir your feelings. Okay. And this is going to be good. Then we see the energy of love yourself first. So whatever is transpiring, I see a love triangle going on. And it's as if your angels and guides are saying, love yourself first. Because once you love yourself first, you're not going to be. Only people who want to be playful and in these sort of a love triangles that you know that someone else has seen someone else and you're still seeing them. I see attraction. And this came up. A lot of our people... Um, some of you are going to be finding out that a friend is your true love and this friend is very attractive to you. Okay. So some of you could have a friend and you're going to be finding out in this month that this friend is very much attracted to you and, um, they are your true love. That's kind of weird, huh? <laughs> Oh my God. Okay. So I see some reconciliation is coming in. So men, 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 if you wanted to reconciliate with someone from the past, it's happening. I see you men are thinking about it. I see you young men really want to return to someone um, who you have known in either a past life or you have met. And this is the people between the ages of 25 18 and 25 or 18 and 35 i see you you are hoping um to return to this person okay um this could be the one i see some of you um were friends with someone you had a one night stand and you are pregnant um they want you to um commit in a relationship and this is going to be good so make the effort because they really care about you. They want you to commit in a relationship. I see they're going to be taking up their responsibility. So that is good. I see some codependency. You young men have some codependency. Um, whatever is to inspire, I see some of you young men have some codependency. And I think that some of you 
came out of prison or something like that children are affecting really Capricorns whatever is transpiring whether you want to have kids and I knew when like when I was uh, when um, yeah when you are 30 you just have this thing you just want to have kids so I see a lot of you so I see new love is coming in and whoever this new love is is true love that is coming in for you um, I see you young men especially um, men between the ages of 18 and 50 you want to return to your ex it's as if there's this maybe I've made the wrong decision yes I see um, some of you realize that your ex especially men between the ages of 35 and 45 you realize that your ex was the one for you I see you want to reconciliate I see you want to leave the playfulness behind and reconciliate with your ex I see that a love triangle is over and you're happy that this is over some of you were in a love triangle with a scorpion and you're happy that it's over I see no communication is here whatever is transpired I'm seeing no communication here whatever that has been transpired I see some of you are going to be receiving a child you could be the baby could be coming in and is someone um, you have known from a past life some of you are really going to be getting pregnant um, um, it's as if you met you have met this person you visualize this your soulmate or twin flame they came in I see heartbreaks with a new love and this was a true love someone was attracted to someone out there and um, whoever this person is has broken your heart I see you shutting down you are shutting down um, you men want to return to another Capricorn you realize that this Capricorn was the love of your life and you want to return to another Capricorn again I said this some of you are in um, a friendship with a um, especially the, the women 50 years and older I see you look very attractive I see people are really looking at you um, I see um, some of you are not aware of that People might be thinking yeah this is a person that I want to share my life with or this is a person that I want to have a family with um, I see that you ladies um, you know yours you're just sparkling off the chart I see some of you um, men are thinking about to um, balance out the situation I see you want to return to the ex and I see you men are really considering this now um, if you choose to do that I see that you are going to be doing the right thing so men who wants to return to the ex I see you could be doing the, the right thing new love is coming in and I see some of you are very attracted to a Virgo that is coming in okay extremely attracted to this Virgo I see justice justice um so this is really positive um if there was some issues um in a family i see attractiveness but it's as if if some of you were asking if this is a person for you it is a yes okay i see some of you women um is just absolutely looking fabulous some of you um wants to get um wants to create a family with a virgo okay i see a message that is coming in this message that is coming in is coming in from a pisces cancer or a scorpion it could be your child this message is it could be your child or it could be um but but whatever is transpiring with this this connection and this information is very important I see some of you turning your back on your marriage or ending a marriage um, and I see you are protecting your kids in this process so whatever that was transpiring and happening I see you definitely 
protecting your kids in the process so some of you there is no communication that is transpiring especially with a new love whatever has transpired um, there's absolutely no commit um, communication I see news is going to be coming in from a Pisces cancer or scorpion they could be saying that they want to divorce you um, however that is going to be working out and playing out uh, however um, this issue and situation is good some of you are wondering if a woman a Virgo woman is the right person yes she is so um Capricorns is going to be a good 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 um month okay it's going to be a good good month for you and I think why Capricorns is because you're not really focused on love okay it is it's as if um, some of you are really connected some of you are going to be moving in together and I think that this is good whatever is happening or whatever is transpiring I see some of you really moving in together however that is coming up and transpiring for you I see you're moving um, you're gonna be um, um, moving in together there is codependency that is happening but it's happening with you young men between the ages of uh, um, 18 and 25 that there, there is you are having a codependency in your relationship but you're trying to balance it out and this is going to be good the heartbreaks that is coming up is definitely with a true love someone who you really truly love I see some heartbreaks I see some um, love I, I see some of you need to love yourself more okay because it's as if you're giving your love to someone who is not really understanding and not really loving you back the way you should be and I see some of you are just gonna give up on a relationship and just said you know something it's um, it's good I'm letting this go and as soon as you let go this love is going to be coming in um definitely I see that um, some of you um heartbreaks are here and it's going to be affecting um it could be some of you a new love came in that was a a virgo and you know that this is someone who was meant for you but there is some there is like a libra lurking around okay a Libra could be lurking around this person that means um, it could be the ex that they're not letting go off so I see you guys and, and, and especially for the ladies uh, um, the ladies um, 45 years uh, 50 years and older I see this is um, coming up for you okay so what is this art breaks is it's like there's no communication between you and this person what does this art breaks about judgment and you start and yeah so um what we're seeing here capricorns um and it could be affecting any one of you now um capri so you wanted a new start there's you know you were open you wanted to communicate but it's as if you can't communicate this you wanted to let um, this new love came in but there was some blocks because of miscommunication or no communication but you feel it in your soul that this could be the one for you okay but you know you you're thinking okay if this person doesn't want to communicate to me then it's okay let me let it go but you're dying inside and um, only if you know that this person you were meant to be together because you would have this could be a soulmate or a twin flame but I see you having so much as, as if you you you, you finally met someone but you really don't want to open your heart to this person um, but this person is a soulmate or a twin flame for some of you okay um, it's as if you met the person but you you know 
you don't really want to tell them that you're attracted to them, that you really like them, that you really care for them. And I see um, this is really happening. Children, in whatever way, some of you could be getting pregnant, some of you some of you definitely could be getting pregnant, but some of you could be um, really, really um, going to be um, um, having a child. Um, I see a lot of you moving in. Um, definitely a lot of you are going to decide to move in um, with a new love, okay? And create a new family. A lot of you, I think... It's, it's as if a lot of you decide it is the right thing to do to move in with this person so this is positive because I see a lot of you are really understanding and it's as if it's the right thing to do to move in with this person so these are wonderful positive alignment of energies that is coming in so I see some of you are going to be um, if you are open for a new relationship, I see the universe is going to be definitely sending you someone in. And this is going to be wonderful. I see some good news is coming in. And this news is coming in. If you are trying to get pregnant or if you have been for quite some time trying to get pregnant or you're doing in virtual or however way to get pregnant, I see this is going to be happening for you guys. So this is good. So, um definitely um but a lot of you are going to be getting pregnant or finding out that you're pregnant okay um a lot of you also are trying to find a way to reconnect um with a past love and this past love could be um coming in where you want to some of you take the time to reconsider something and you want to go back to a past love because you think that that person gave you so much um that's where the love lies it's, it's as if you're thinking oh my god was i crazy or something to let go of that person okay um a lot of you are just going to be fabulous i see um you latest 50 years and older i see you could be moving in or you could be collaborating to live together i see because you know i see some of you saying you know i'm 50 years old it's good to have a partner so i see that you're going to be shifting from out of being alone um or living alone um shifting in a new relationship and i see this is coming up I see a lot of you are going to be considering children also. It's as if I think some of you think, yeah, maybe it's time. I see like some of you, your biological clock is like ticking and it's going to be like, okay, all right. I have been wondering, do I, do I want to have kids with this person? Is this person a good father? Will this person become a good father for my kid and that sort of a thing and i think um you're gonna say yes um i definitely see that a lot of you are going to be asked um to move in or collaborate with someone so let's say that some of you are going to be uh, giving up your apartment and then moving in someone's house if whoever has the house that's how you're going to be doing this but I see the women 50 years and older. I see marriage is here or a new start with a twin flame or soulmate is going to be coming up. Um, and especially the people 50 years and older, I see you having this sort of a firm stability in your relationship. Okay. It's not showing up. If you or Amanda is in a relationship with a Gemini or a Virgo, I see long-term stability is in this relationship. Um, but for the rest of you, it's it's about a month where you're going to be thinking, do I want to spend the rest of my life with this person having kids? Because Capricorn people are one of the most uh, 
um, pragmatic people because you think who you want to have a child with and who you want to be connected with whether with a child or so you will prefer if you don't find the right person to be your child's um, father I see um, Capcom people are always like you know they have to really really love you um, to open up their life to you so that they will even consider having a child a child if they didn't get pregnant out of really knowing this so a uh, wonderful alignment of energy is coming up and I so do um, love you guys remember in order to see the extended of this reading you have to use the link below I love you guys lots of love please like share 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 this video love is the only thing that is real namaste until next time